Hey guys, uh, I'm Zach and I'm in the driver's seat. I'm Juliana and I'm in the back seat. And we're doing it wrong. I've got Hugh here. I picked this up on a Humble Bundle a couple weeks ago and I think it looks really cool. I really like the soundtrack already and I like the, the art style for sure. Yeah, also the concept once we get into gameplay seemed really interesting. Mm -hmm. um, so we'll kind of be exploring colors. Yeah. Hence the name Hugh, but anyway. Um, so let's get into it. Yeah. Um, also, this said it was controller recommended, so. Controller's not working. So. Watch the edits. Alright. Let's fix the jump. Ooh, mail. <laughs> Dearest Hugh. Oh, I've had the most dreadful luck. I feel terrible that you've been left alone all this time. The traitorous Dr. Grey tried to steal the annular spectrum, a ring I developed to allow perception and alteration of color. Some call them impossible colors. <laughs> impossible for Dr. Grey, maybe. Anyway, something went wrong. I turned a strange shade and became invisible. The ring, it, it fractured, scattering colored shards far and wide. Hmm. I stayed at home for many weeks, watching, waiting, existing on this colored plane. I couldn't speak to you, nor interact with anything in the mono world. So I left. I left for the university where I hid away the colored tools I had created. I pray you have found what is left of the ring. Excellent story, Tally. Yeah. Some sort of dream sequence. Can you interact with anything, or like the? I guess not. Fisherman got a glimpse of something. Something unusual. Down past the lighthouse. Okay. I can't, I can't oh, do anything. Can't, yep, nope. You gotta have the ring. Yep. Down past. Oh, hey! Well, it's blue. to the sky and declared it blue. It is this shared vision, this unquestioned understanding which connects us. But are you really seeing blue the same way I see it? Perhaps blue is nothing more than a shade of grey to you. Perhaps mm. everyone in this world sees nothing but shades of grey. Don't you see, Hugh? This, this is why we're here. Hmm. Can you not get into the doors anymore? Hmm. Can you jump or... I can. Oh! There's a thing up there. Now I just have to be able to reach it, which means there's probably another color that we need to find to do that. a really interesting concept. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, can you change? Hello? Hugh, is that you? Thank goodness I've been trapped for days. Help me get out of here. Oh. I keep hearing noises. It's creeping me out. Turn on the... There we go. The rocks, they... They just disappeared. I don't know how you did it. 
Who cares? I'm saved. Thank you. Hmm. Nice. Enter a cave expecting a waterfall, the chances are your expectations will be met. But if you discard those expectations, don't you think instead the cave will be full of surprises? I ask for you, Hugh, to abandon your expectations, to pull me back from the brink of unreality. I need you to see the world not for what it is, but for what it can be. Ask of their children. Something like that. Just this is, a thought. This is really interesting. Yeah, no, it's a great little concept. Mm hmm. Well executed, I'd say. <clears throat> oh, hello there. You startled me. I'm just resting my legs. Don't play too close to the water now. Get as close to the box as you can before changing. Or, yeah, that, that works too. <laughs> Or switch into blue. Once I switch into blue, I can't switch out of it again. You can? Oh! Oh, those were spikes. I did not realize that. Okay, so... You can't switch back to gray after that? At all? Okay, well you can, but there's nothing that can be done. Okay. That might be a comeback later thing. Mm -hmm. And there's things and there's doing and the thingies and the uh. all right. 
Spike. Spike. More rocks. Safety. Yeah. Safety. Safety is found. <laughs> Fucking. <sighs> okay, let's see how far we got. Oh. Oh. Okay, you can do this. You've done it before. You can do it again. I believe. I do like how they have the water stop running when you walk under it. Yeah. It's details like that that make me think they did a really good job with mm -hmm. this game. Not because they they have to, but because. Well, they chose to. Yes, exactly. Who are you? Are you Dr. Gray? Try to go to blue. Ah. <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> Did you know, Hugh, that purple is at the very end of the visible spectrum? It's the hardest color for our eyes to distinguish. Now, imagine a shade one step further than purple, a color beyond what we can actually perceive. We call these impossible colors. And I fear that this, this is where I currently reside. If reality is rooted in our perception, and you cannot perceive me, do I even exist to you? I'm sure that I do. I mean, you're reading this letter, or, or at least I hope you are. I'm sorry, but existing in this strange state of impermanence hmm. does funny things to you, Hugh. It makes you question. Yeah. What is real? Okay. I'll be very careful. Mm -hmm. Or, you know. Just do the thing. Okay. <laughs> Use the mechanics of the game to my advantage. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay. So, so we're round one of blue. blue. Oh, uh, you're gonna wait a minute. <laughs> oh, what? Snap, crackle, pop. Get fucked. Ah. Oh. 
got to jump and, then and do it. Yeah, and do it. At, yep. Okay, my bad. Blue. Wait. Purple. Jump. Blue. Jump. Purple. Ooh. Jump. Blue. Jump. Ooh. Okay. Um. I think we're gonna leave this here for now. Yeah. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope that this is a really cool game. I really yeah, like no, this game. I like this a lot. Um, this is a really cool concept that I think is really well executed. And as somebody who does, who likes physics and colors and waveforms, this is really actually pretty interesting concept of uh, filters and yeah. Anyway, sorry, I'm gonna geek out a little bit here for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, thank you guys again for watching. Yes, thank you so much. Um, let us know if we're doing it wrong in the comments down below. Yeah. And um, like, comment, subscribe, please, and thank you. Yes. Um, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Yep. Bye. Little.